The family settled in to celebrate New Year's Eve. They expected they might hear some fireworks popping off, but they didn't expect to have a bullet come through their kitchen window. This is the big hole and it kind of ricocheted and it went over there. Joe Helen Browning believes the bullet that went into her kitchen was from celebratory gunfire on New Year's Eve. She and her son had just been in the kitchen putting up groceries at their home on Sunset Circle. And as soon as I got back to my bedroom, I heard like two gunshots and it was like around 620. Startled by what happened, Browning called Grandview Police. I mean, we were just nervous and after we went in my room and, and we sat on the bed for a little while, um, we heard some more started going off and we both just jumped just fell to the floor. With their anxiety up, Browning and her son ended up checking into a nearby hotel for the night. Just before the New Year's Eve holiday, the Kansas City, Missouri Police Department warned people against celebratory gunfire. The department said last year its gunshot detection system, or shot spotter, recorded more than 1,600 rounds. Browning believes she had some angels on her side. Her message to others, Think twice before shooting off celebratory shots. It could have deadly consequences. I could have easily just been standing right there. And I asked the cop, I said, was, is it a, I said, what, what kind of gun bullet was that? And he was like, oh, it was a, a 45 or a 9 millimeter. I said, well, could it have, have killed anybody? He was like, yes, you would have died. Anybody would have died if it would have hit someone. Monica Castro, Fox 4, working for you.